How's it going guys? This week I'm making this sign for my workshop. If you guys want to see how to make one for your own workshop, stay tuned and I'll be glad to show you. So for this project I'm going to be using some 3 8 inch plywood and some quarter inch plywood that I have underneath here. And the main reason I'm using this plywood is because it's kind of what I have laying around the shop. I just got it the other day from my neighbor and uh, it's going to be perfect for this project. Now if I was going to go to the store and buy some wood, I'd probably buy some quarter inch plywood because it really doesn't need to be that thick. It's just a sign. It's not really uh, it's not really holding anything up. So you should be all set with quarter inch plywood, but I'm gonna use a little bit thicker plywood for the backing just cause it's all I have. Now, once you get your plywood, it's basically gonna depend on how much you need is totally depending on how big of a sign that you wanna make. Now my sign isn't gonna be huge, so I don't really have that much plywood. But uh, once you get your sign selected out, you wanna print it out in some type of uh, logo. So I basically took my logo and I created it into a PDF document and I printed off a bunch of different pieces to it. So there I have the shaping or since 2013 spot and basically I have all my letters cut out in here. So um, I can go ahead and attach these using some spray adhesive and let's go ahead and do that right now.
guys, here you have it. The sign is all done. I think it came out really good. I mean, it was a lot of work cutting out all the letters and the saw blade and the acorn and everything, but it was well worth it once you see the final product. So I definitely recommend it. If you want to make a sign of your own, then go ahead. I mean, it's a lot of fun and it's cool to see it come to life at the very end. So if you guys like this project, please give it a thumbs up. And don't forget, if you're new, subscribe. I try to post new woodworking videos almost every Tuesday. And if you haven't already, go follow me over on Twitter where you can check out updates throughout the week and stuff like that. I may even have a sneak preview of this project ahead of time before it's actually posted here on YouTube. So if you guys like it, don't forget to give it a thumbs up and please share this video so all your friends and everybody can see it. That really helps us out a lot. So thank you very much for watching and I'll see you guys next week.